Hey guys! So, um, I have missed two streams. Uh, one because, uh, I was feeling kind of under the weather. And, uh, I just wanted to bring y'all up to speed because I think you guys think I'm just kind of ditching on the channel with being busy with moving, and I'm really not. Uh, but once you see this, you'll understand when I said there was going to be an interruption to the channel. Okay? So we've closed down the new condo. Okay? We have upgraded the, uh, studio. I have managed to paint the kids' room. Kids' room is painted. Uh, they need a new scratching post. I need to move the boys in. Uh, but, uh, she has been obnoxiously clingy ever since a vast majority of boxes have moved in. Which brings us to an update on the studio. Uh, yes, that's right. Uh, <laughs> bro, this is the hot mess right now. I actually am trying to, it's a Monday, as you all know, so I'm trying to get something done, because, you know, we've set the schedule to Mondays and streaming, and yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right. Hi. I have a Brooklyn between my legs. All right. First off, there is the old chair, and then there's the new chair, Okay. Now, you'll notice that the camera rig is off the wall, because we're buying a new camera rig. And a new camera to go over the drafting table, okay? You'll notice my knickknacks are off the shelf over here, and the briar horses are off that shelf right there. Uh, but you will notice <laughs> a huge explosion in boxes. So, if you're uh, following um, the Facebook posts, you will know that our box count is at 17. One. And seven, I have to hold the phone with my other two hand, so, uh, you know, 17, okay? Here's a problem. Here's a big problem, okay? Yeah, that cabinet's a problem, okay? And uh, if you go over here, all of this is not going to go into boxes because it's pretty well self-contained. Then you have the filing cabinet, okay? So, uh, so we're doing box count here. So we're doing one, two, three, four. Okay, there's nothing in this book that's going to have stuff in it. Okay, so that's another four. So now we're at, in case you missed your counter, 22. Uh, then we're going to come to this closet here. Now you're going to see that um, all of the pads of paper are off of there. But those pads of paper don't necessarily fit in a box. So I'm going to get a bigger box. We're going to make that. Uh, that's going to be 23 is all those pads of paper. We got stuff up on the top shelf. That'll probably be eh, another box, okay? Here's the problem. I got all these drawers. Those drawers. Yeah. These drawers are not going in another box. So we're going to count every single one of these drawers as its own box rather than packing it and unpacking it. It's just senseless. Okay, so we can add another three drawers. So what we were at, like, I lost count. Okay, so that's another three. I'm going to have to get a counter going on this video. So add another three. And then you get finished pieces. And more raw canvases. Now, as you have known through the years, this closet is hella packed. And the new closet is much bigger, okay? It's a walk-in closet. I've got a few people that are a little salty at me because it's basically supposed to be the master bedroom suite. And that's not what I'm using it for. That's not what I'm using it for at all. I apologize. The cats have been very needy, so I have cat hair in my nose. Okay. Up in the attic of the cottage, I have a printer. That's not going in a box. So we can count that as, ding, another freaking box. All right. Now, in the cottage, you have these two storage units. Guess what? I have to take these apart in order to get them out of this cabinet. So we're going to count this as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more boxes. Eight and nine. These kind of pull out by themselves, okay? Ten for the ornaments that are down there. So that's another ten just in this housing whatsoever. And we aren't even including the fact that little blue is down there. And that his enclosure is actually still in the storage unit. Okay? So that's another two, okay? Um, this is actually going to be its own thing in a box with... Uh, I believe these are the pastel pencils. 
Uh, these are the ink tense pencils, and then these are the watercolor pencils. So that's another box. Ching! See, y'all thought this was going to be redonkulous. We're well over 20. Okay. That's just the top rack. You forget, this thing has two stories. It's like my house. Okay. So now you've got... all those books okay well that is three boxes worth of books so add in your counter another three boxes okay <clears throat> Ew. sorry my calves are very sore from going up and down the stairs now this cottage has to get disassembled in order to move it keep in mind when i bought it I assembled it in the studio. So this whole thing has to get disassembled so we can move it out. I have officially lost track of how many boxes we have now talked about. Let's scooch over, okay? So then we've got all the finished, well I shouldn't say finished, but they're work in progress paintings. Yeah, the galaxy horse is in there. One of these days I'm going to get over my hump with that, but you know what? We've got, we've got the galaxy horse in there, we've got the black bucks in there, we've got um, SSA Snort and Blow, which I, I'm not looking forward to finishing that. A couple blank canvases, and we have a Midnight Snack in there, so, yeah, that's another box, okay? Laptop and the old Wacom. Now we're getting into the hard stuff. So before any of this hardware and electronics moves, we got to finish the studio, Okay. Before we do any of that, okay? But let's move over. We got the drafting table. So uh, probably another box that's going to be like miscellaneous crap for the drafting table. It's pencils and pencil sharpeners. Probably the mounting hardware for that monitor. Uh, <laughs> I missed when I did my flora and fauna pack that uh, that fern also needs to go in there. Uh, clearly the uh, planter is going to be its own damn thing, so chalk another box up, okay? This can go, this is all the um, colored pencils, okay? That can go in a box with the ink tents and all the other pencils. Here's all our charcoal pencil blending stumps and uh, graphite powder, or charcoal powder, charcoal powder. All right, then you got our masterful planter full of paintbrushes. That's another box. That's right, it's another box, okay? Then we got to disassemble this rig right here, okay, because that is actually um, bolted to the wall on 2 by 4s So, once you get past all that, you still have two big office chairs in here. And this is why I say there hasn't been a hell of a lot, to, you know, getting done in here. I don't have, I don't have much floor space, okay. Now, that's 17 boxes, okay. Okay, this studio is full, okay? We are to the eyeballs full, okay? Now we're going to go into the living, okay? It's a short walk. It's not going to be a short walk after these videos, I'll tell you what. All right, so now we got this table here, which is actually a patio table. It's going to go out on the actual balcony. That's actually off the studio. You guys don't know until now that there's a balcony off the studio. So we're gonna, you're gonna probably see this again on maybe like a, a summer kind of ambient chat kind of thing. Where it's a segment I want to start. Can't really do ambient chats in the studio because I get too distracted. All right, then you got all these boxes. I don't even have room to walk. Okay, I got a un, I've got a pack up. This hutch, I've got to pack up this entertainment center, okay? Um, the decor on the walls, got to pack up the TV, and wall-to-wall -wall boxes. And this isn't even the stuff that's already in the storage unit. No, 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 this is just the stuff that's in the apartment. All right, so you're like, well, don't you have a second bedroom? Glad you asked. I do have a master bedroom. And it is half packed. Like I said, she has been a small dog. She's been following me everywhere. 
She jumps in the car. She needs to go to the condo. She spent all day yesterday at the condo. Um, unsupervised with her sister. Unsupervised with her sister. Locked in their room, because their kid, the kids are going to get their own room. Uh, and her sister, Little Dutch, spent her whole day cowering in the carrier, even though she was literally, there's nothing happening. And, and just in case you're wondering, this is what Dutch looks like on a normal on the normal, she's she's just little dashes. I don't want to move. Why do we have to move? I like everything here. Change is bad. She's still recovering from her surgery because she got spayed. Uh, so she's she's on a a pretty DL kind of thing. But as you can see, we're still kind of packing things up. I still have to pack that headboard up and. The new bedroom has a, there's three bedrooms. So I kind of gave myself on accident the, the, the most awkward bedroom. Um, this bedroom is 12 by 13. The office is 11 by, 10 by 11, okay? The new studio is 12 by 16, so it's much, much longer. It's actually almost as big as the basement which is going to become an entertainment center and then the second bedroom which has the smallest of the three closets i thought was going to be uh the second or I, you know the one that's between the studio and what is going to be the master bedroom i thought was going to be the second or the smallest bedroom because it's got the smallest closet so i went with the closet that matches this one And it's 9 by 12. Yeah, I'm not sure how that bedroom is going to... It's a good thing there's really nothing going in the bedroom because this would be the only thing. And so I can maybe once in a blue moon do my makeup. Uh, the window layout is also different. Uh, so there's a lot of packing still going on. Um... Lots of packing. I'm hoping to hear from U-Haul today about whether or not today I can actually get a truck, empty out the storage unit, and put some of this in the condo today. Um, the countertops are getting measured, so hopefully they will be done in the next week or so. I don't know. It's going to be really hard to book this because... <sighs> I used to get two days off a week. And then people who shall remain nameless, but wholly despised, uh, decided that they were going to just be utter douche canoes. So now I only get one day off a week. And I have to move, do the stream, set up the studio, get countertops and a refrigerator installed while I'm... Just having one day off and 10 extra hours a week. Okay. So just in case you were wondering how this was going to hit the stream, I was kind of afraid that this was going to happen. And then that's kind of how it happens. So, today, there's more packing. We'll get more of that in boxes. Um, my calf... If you haven't noticed me having a slight limp today, my calf had a massive Charlie horse last night, like mule kicking Charlie horse time. Um, and it really hurts to walk on it. Uh, so not having a U-Haul today might work in my favor. But, but, uh, I do want to get back to the condo today. I have to get back there while the, the guys are measuring for the countertops. And, um, I'm going to start painting the studio, and it is not going to be white. I mean, don't get me wrong. Some of it's going to be white. Some of it's going to be white. An equivalent of a four-room wall, a four-room comparison. Okay, this is how this is going to go. That wall's going to be green. That wall's going to be green. That wall's going to be white. And that wall's going to be white. So... A little bit less light casting and a little bit more to push the back of the room out of the camera range. So, 
And in case you're wondering, the level of green we're talking about... I really hope that that's not paint. I don't think it's paint. Well, that's paint. Okay. So we're talking like a deep forest green. So, still doing. Uh, thanks for being patient. Uh, sorry I haven't posted more content, but there's uh, reasons. And uh, me and my little cat dog. Hi. Hi. Can we say hello to everybody? No. You're such a brat. You're a brat. We're going to get some work done today. So, uh, I'm going to go have some breakfast and get some packing done, head down to the condo, get some painting done, and maybe the whole... I gotta be the only one that just try, decides to buy a condo or buy a new house and then get all this done and not take extra time off because that's retarded. Alright, I'll catch you later, guys. Bye!